Hello everyone, today I'm just gonna share my thoughts on the 2020 August wave of LEGO Marvel Super Heroes sets. First up is 76,152 The Wrath of Loki. This is a junior set which means bigger pieces and clunky builds but it's still a pretty decent set. But it does not have to be $60 for 223 pieces. God damn, the figures are really good though. Great new Loki. Next up, 76,153 Helicarrier. This one looks amazing. I like the build for Modic and the figures are super cool. I like the Nick Fury. And a great build for the Helicarrier. Doesn't look too clunky. Okay, third is the Hulkbuster vs. AIM Agents, 76,154. Oh boy, Pancake Head looking ass. Rescue Minifigure is awesome. I hate the clunky shoulder build though. Really hope it's removable, AIM agents are nothing special. Second to last is 76,155 Avengers Tower Battle. Oh my god I love this set. The build is so amazing. It's so much better than the 2015 version which only had 3 stories. The new Red Skull looks interesting. I like the two new Iron Man suits as well. Also, it includes an Infinity Gauntlet. Thank you to you slash Slurm at the log for pointing this out. Cheapest way to get that piece now. Figures are nothing to write home about though. It also includes a teal brick separator which I thought I'd point out. Finally is 76,156 Iron Man Helmet. This one, I don't know. I feel like it was a great concept but the execution fell flat somewhere. I like the use of the new gold. The eyes could use some improvements though. It's a decent build for $40. Overall, pretty good. Something just looks off. In a hoe, that wraps up my review of the August 2020 wave of Marvel sets. Any and all feedback would be appreciated.